Hello and welcome back to the channel. So today I thought we would do a little update on some of my recent Hot Wheels hunting finds as well as just some other stuff that we got in the mail. So starting off here, as you can see, we have a brand new mat and that is courtesy here of Dream Customs. So I ended up getting two of their mats and the quality is very, very nice comes in these cool um, little like carrying bags for travel, which is nice. Uh, but yeah, overall quality, super, super nice. And I think they definitely look good on camera and cars fit nice in all the spots. So I will probably showcase those a little more once we get the new Hot Wheels set up. And something else that you probably notice here right off the bat is the Lamborghini Miura Super Treasure Hunt. I ended up doing a trade with die cash cars. So I traded that um, Honda Civic hatch super treasure hunt and traded that for this Mira, which I was a little more interested in. And this one is factory sealed, but I think we are going to be cracking this bad boy open. So I know that might make some of you a little upset, but it just kind of is what it is, folks. We crack stuff open here. And I also picked up the golden nugget it's a beaut, clock. It's a beaut. <laughs> so i ended up getting a gift card from work and ended up picking this up off makari already loose so i did not crack it open but man seeing this thing in person is absolutely killer this car is so cool and i see why there is such a hype around it and actually on christmas day i filmed a whole super video and actually cracked open this 82 mark 3 toyota super uh super treasure hunt so i actually have the have the card here right here but the whole video audio got corrupted and the whole video was just kind of a sham and i was trying to do like some voiceover stuff and it just wasn't really working out so i basically just scrapped the whole video and so now i'm just kind of combining that opening here with this like mail time update. So I probably throw threw in a couple clips of me cracking it open. Uh, but yeah, kind of a shame that whole super video kinda kinda went to waste. But I mean, just kinda how it goes sometimes. And then some finds while I was out doing some last minute Christmas shopping was the R35 Liberty Walk GTR. Uh, team transport. I was so shocked when I walked up and saw this thing just hanging there on the pegs. I actually made a reel about it. I think it actually got like quite a few views, which is cool. But I honestly just could not believe when I walked up and saw this thing on the pegs. This thing has some major weight to it. This is super heavy and we will be cracking this open, but that will be on a separate video. But I am very excited to crack it open because this hauler has like the cool like gold wing style doors on it. So this is something that we will for sure be cracking open in the near future. Also on my hunt, just a random main line that I actually never found was the Bugatti Bleed. So this was a very cool new release in 2023 and I just never ended up finding it, but we finally got one. So we will be cracking it open. And another find that I was super excited about was this Ultra Hot Fair Lady Z. So this was actually the last Ultra Hot that I needed to complete the full set, I think, of Wave 1 and 2. So that was very cool. Like Once again, very surprised to see this one setting on the pegs. And this will also for sure be getting cracked open. And last up here on my hunting finds so this was from the newest car culture set modern classics the volkswagen corrado vr6 so i just really like the color and the wheel choice on this one that's why i picked it up um none of these i did not pick any of these up and the spoon civic of course was gone but i actually just won this spoon civic in a instagram raffle so that will be coming to the channel shortly too, but this will also be getting cracked open. And another mail call here from Mini GT, 
is the McLaren F1 GTR. So this is actually competing right now in the Lamley Awards for the best overall cast of the year. So this was one that I for sure had to pick up. Uh, I mean, obviously it looks great. And I mean, the Lamley polls are definitely showing. So excited to crack into this guy. Actually ended up changing my mind and we are cracking this bad boy open right now. So as always, Mini GTs come with these sweet cases. This one looks especially nice. I don't know if that gloss on there is kind of new, uh, but actually it kind of has like a little like texture to the Mini GT logo as well, which is very nice. But let's get over the box and check out the car. Man, this thing is so so nice i love the wheels man yes so as good as this thing looks on photos and in the you know lamley poles man, it looks even better in person man this is sweet so you have to let me know is this one that you guys pick up or do you guys follow the lamley polling at all just be curious to see um, what my audience is here but Interesting that the center caps are red on this side and blue on the other side. So if anyone knows the reasoning for that, I guess also let me know down below. I also ended up making a order from, I think this was from Wheel Collectors. So there was one car in particular I really wanted and I ended up adding a couple more to the cart that I probably won't end up finding in stores anytime soon, but here we have the Nissan Skyline RS KDR30. So this is from, well, this is an international card. So I'm actually not sure what case this is from. I think it might be from A or B case. Um, but like I said, my area is like so far behind that who knows when I'll even see that. Uh, I also picked up the Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 in yellow which is a very cool color combo. And we grabbed the HKS Ford Ranger Raptor. So as you know, I have a very big Hot Wheels HKS collection. So this will go nicely in that. We also picked up the Porsche 911 GT3 from Matchbox. I just opened up the red one that I found in store. And then I saw this white one as well. So picked it up, so excited to add another one of those. And to go along with our Golden Nugget, we got two of the new Golden Nugget 2.0s. So a pretty cool release, especially after all the hype of the Super Treasure Hunt, that they kind of released like a, another version of it, but this time in the coupe instead of the hatch. So we'll throw this up here, do a little comparison. So it's definitely not super treasure hunt paint but i mean it looks very cool got the same red interior i really want to find a set of these wheels to throw on here so they'll match but having a hard time finding a set of those exact shade six spokes so if anyone knows where i can get some or has a pair up for sale let me know because i think it'd be super cool to have both these cars with the same wheels like matching interior and everything so that is why I got two of these. And last up here, we have three super premium cars here. These are Inno 64, and this is the Liberty Walk Ferrari F40. So I watched Bullet Tony Customs video where he unboxed, um, I think it was the black one. And I'd been seeing these online and looking at them a lot and just didn't pull the trigger. And after his video, I was like, man, I definitely need to pick one of these up. So of course I got a couple of them. So this was the red and we have the white version here too. Super, super cool. And then also there is this special edition one, which is a chance for a chase. So I think, yes, the normal is going to be the matte black but i think it's kind of like a brushed like aluminum finish if you have the chase so the option i think i got these from my guy collectibles so the option was 25 dollars for the guaranteed matte black 
and it was $30 for a sealed one with a chance at the chase. So you know we got sealed with the chance of the chase and we aren't gonna do the full unboxing, but I figured we would at least open this up enough here to see if we got the chase or not. So fingers crossed, but if not, I think even the all black one looks super cool. Hong Kong Toy Car Salon 2023 Special Edition. Okay, so I can't see it yet. Okay, we did not get the chase. But man, that thing is sweet. Look at this case and everything. Man, I cannot wait. These definitely are going to have to be their own video and get a lot of attention on them because these things are killer. Depending on how much I like them, we might have to go try to pick up the chase because man, these are sweet. Well, that is going to do it for today's video. I just wanted to do a quick recap and just kind of go over all the stuff that we acquired recently, like kind of before and after the Christmas break here and just kind of get you guys tuned up and ready for our unboxings, which as you can see, we are going to have a bunch of cool unboxings. I'm probably going to go film some shorts right now and maybe just crack um, some of the main lines but you can be looking forward to a super treasure hunt crack along with that uh, team transport liberty walk then we got the ferrari f40s so a bunch of really cool stuff coming up so definitely stay tuned and with that hope you enjoyed today's video if so be sure to like comment and subscribe and we will catch you on the next upload peace